and welcome to my first video of 2015. Yes, it need to be said. And this is instantly annoying me. Yes, I usually have posters here and here, but uh, I'm just going to tell you this now. There's things called glue spots that are kind of like sort of a substitute for blue tack. They are not a substitute for blue tack. Do not buy glue spots if you intend on hanging up posters because they are absolutely 100% useless. Anyway, as one year ends and we usher in another, usually with partying and fireworks and maybe a spot of drinking if you're of course of legal age, and if you're not, you shouldn't be. Drinking is bad. Kids, don't do it. Leave it to the adults. Many find themselves making New Year's resolutions, and for some, these usually can be achievable, or if they are a bit audacious, some do manage to follow through, but one thing I've noticed, particularly with myself, is that I, and as do many other people, lack the resolve to do them, and that is why I, for one, am not making any New Year's resolutions this year. I've given up on this ideal that it's a case of, with a new year comes a new person to emerge from the person we left behind in the last year. I commend those that do manage to f to follow through on their New Year's resolutions, and I am quite envious of those that do so. But I just see many people getting disappointed, particularly for those that tend to set themselves really audacious, or like the kind of standard New Year's resolutions of like, I'm gonna get fit, or I am gonna be more financially secure and aware and not spend all my money on food and alcohol and various other things besides, or Netflix, or things like playing instruments, or going travelling and things like that, and one thing I've noticed is that the big problem with these is that they are year-long resolutions, and a year, despite what some people might think, despite some people being like, well that's really flown by, a year is a long span of time. That's 365 days. One thing I have thought is kind of, as an alternative to New Year's resolutions, Think smaller, and maybe it can lead to something bigger. But if you want to think small, maybe do something you can do in a day. Think something that you can just set aside and make it kind of a certain thing you do in your life. If you have a wrong to right, you write that wrong, whether it's a case of you make sure that you get in touch with a family member, or talk to a friend that you haven't talked to in a while, or something. Or if it's a case of you really want to watch that really cool anime that you've heard about or that really cool show that people keep telling you about, make that a New Year's resolution. I mean, it's not exactly conventional or it's not exactly what most would class as a New Year's resolution, but it's still kind of a thing that going into a new year, it can be like, you know what I'm going to do this year? I'm going to watch the entirety of this anime and I'm going to love it, hopefully. And some of these can lead to you trying new things. So, you know, if you're writing that wrong, maybe it could lead to you becoming a better and understanding person. If you decide to watch that weird anime, or try that new book, or watch that show, or try those films, or things like that, it could lead to you broadening yourself and trying new things, one anime or at a time or something. I don't know why I keep jumping to anime. Maybe I should make 2015 the year where I look for animes and watch them. Or maybe it's a case of if you have an instrument kind of lying around but you don't really play it much, maybe just think of a song you want to learn. And you never know, you might carry on from that momentum to be like, yeah, okay, let's let's play this instrument more. Yeah, maybe maybe I could do that. Maybe maybe that's a thing I could do. Or you might say to yourself, hey, I'm gonna like walk up this mountain with a group of people and that might encourage you to do more exercise or I'm going to try this sport at my school or local sports center and that could lead to you becoming more active. So yeah this is kind of thinking about this I, I see it as a way to prevent possible disappointment and looking down on yourself and maybe slipping into old habits that you'd rather kick, and by taking a step backwards from it, and thinking, hmm, 
where could I start? Starting is always the road to finishing. I don't know. I'm not like some in inspirational speaker. What do I know? I'm just some guy rambling on the internet. Anyway, you kind of get the idea of what I was trying to say. This had no clear moral. This had no clear message, I don't think. Writing this, it was kind of like, I really want to do this video, but at the same time, it's probably just going to go around in a big fat circle. So, I hope you were totally okay, okay with that. And if you weren't, well, I'm sorry. I made this video. Hmm. Anyway, I wish you all the best. Um, I hope you had a fun New Year's, and hope 2015 is great for you all, as it deserves, as you deserve. Um, coming this year, there will be a lot more stuff, both here and on my main channel, The Gaming Dave. Um, and yeah, I would appreciate it if you would come along for the ride with me. You know, subscribe and all that. So yeah, I'm Dave Nickel. And I'll see you next time. Hopefully, with posters up. Pointing gamers, so on point. Bye.